we have another fun paper to do today. It says, look at the letter at the beginning of each row, say the name of each picture, and circle the pictures that end with the, co the consonant sound. So we have to listen for the end sound, not the beginning, the end of it. So we are going to look at each of these pictures. Let's look. What letter is this right here? P. P. What does P say? <laughs> nice job. So let's look. What is this first picture of a? Kite. A kite. What does kite end with? A T. A T. Good job. What is this? A bow. An, an arrow. An arrow. Good job. Arrow. Does that sound like it ends in p? p, p? No. no. And this last one is a what? Cup. A cup. Say it. Cup. Does cup end in our letter P? Yes. It does. So we're going to take our pencil and we would circle the cup because that ends in P. So we have to listen today. We're not listening for the beginning of a word. We're listening at the end. So we have to really think with our brain and listen with our ears today and look at each picture. Oh, this is going to be a fun paper. Class, stand. Do what I do. Walking, 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 walking. Hop, hop, hop. Hop, hop, hop. Running, running, running. Running, running, running. Now we stop. Now we stop. Good. Now we got some wiggles out. We're ready to do some work. Quietly turn your chairs into the table. <clears throat> Angelina, stand up and do your chair the right way, please. That way your friends can get in. Thank you. Good job. Wow, table one, you're ready to go. Take out your paper. Boys and girls watching you get your paper ready. And take out your pencil. Help her hand in the corner. Oh, I like how Catherine has her elbow up, ready to go. Her eyes even went right on Mrs. Stewart. Good job, Jonathan. He is working hard today. Thank you, Bethany. She's ready to go, too. Your elbow is up. Help her hand in the corner. Daddy says, Buckle up. Mommy says, I love you. And the baby say, I will obey. Great job. Let's look. P says what sound? <laughs> Great job. And what picture would we circle? <laughs> the cup. Go ahead and circle the cup, making a nice, neat circle around the cup. The next letter is K. What does K say? Great job. Let's look. The first picture is a pig. pig. The next picture is milk. milk. And the last picture is an egg. egg. Only one of those pictures has the K sound. The milk. The milk. Good. Circle the milk. Now this next one, I don't want you to say it out loud. I don't want you to say it out loud. I just want you to think in your brain. You are going to say the names of the pictures with me out loud, but don't tell me the answer. You have to use your brain. Listen. What's this, what's this consonant? L. L. What does L say? <laughs> the first picture is a seal. seal. Good. The next picture is a dog. Dog. And the last one is a drum. drum. Now remember, don't tell me the answer yet. Look at your own paper and think which picture you're going to circle that ended in ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm going to say the names again. Seal, dog, drum. One of those pictures ends in ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Do not say it out loud. Follow the directions, please. The next letter is S. What does S say? Good. I see a bird. Say it. Bird. Horn. Horn. And bus. bus. One of those pictures ends in S. Listen again. Bird. Horn. No, you're listening. You're just listening. Horn, bus. Circle the picture that ends in s. Say it in your brain. Pencil to bed. Let's look right here. We did the first two together. You should have circled the cup and the milk. The next one, the L, which picture did you circle? Seal. The seal. Oh, your pencil should be in your desk. Thank you. Seal. Good. So the seal ends in L. Good job. And how about the S? Which picture did you circle? The bus. Seal bus. The bus. Good. The bus ends in S. How did you do, boys and girls watching? Did you circle the right two pictures on that one too? That was a lot of fun. See, we have to use the brain God gave us and be thinking in our brain. Oh, I don't know why I hear all that noise in our desk. Your hands should be in your lap and your eyes right here on me. Turn your paper over and take out your crayons. Put them on your name tag. Oh, I see a cute, what kind of animal would that be we could see at the zoo? Cheetah. Cheetah. It's not a cheetah. Mm -mm. A not a lion. It's a jaguar. Say that. Jaguar. A jaguar. So let's read these blends together. We will start at the bottom of our ladder. Look at the bottom of our ladder and we're going to read up. Begin. Ja. Ja. Oh, that was hurting my ears. That didn't sound nice at all. Let's try that again. Boys and girls watching, you sounded very nice. I could tell you were working hard. All eyes on your paper. Start again. Ja, 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 ja. Good. That sounded much better. Now it's your turn again without my help. All eyes on your paper. Begin. Ja, ja. Nice. Good job. That sounded so much better when you do your own work. All right, let's see. Open up your crayons and let's play our fun game. You're going to circle the blend that you hear in the word that I give you. You are circling the what? The blend. The blend in the word that I give you. Make sure you are looking at your own paper. Here we go. I'm looking for the blend in the word jump, j, uh, j, jump, jump. Circle it with your purple crayon. J, uh, jump. Listen for that vowel. And then purple crayon down. Let me check your work. Let's see. Check those circles. Make them nice and neat, please. Wow. Yes, this table got it. Yes, nice work. Boys and girls watching, did you get the right one? I hope so. All right, which blend did you circle? Tell me the name of the letters. What's the consonant? J. J. And what's the vowel? J. 
Yes. What's the vowel? You. You. So this is the blend that you should have circled right here with your purple crayon. And I checked your papers and you did. Good job. Purple crayons down. And let's look at a different one. Hmm. This next one is, oh, I like to put this on my bagels. I like to eat jam. J -a -j -a jam. Jam. Find the blend you hear in jam. J -a jam. Circle it with your red crayon. My favorite jam is strawberry, and strawberries are what color? Red. red. So that's why we're going to circle with our red crayon. Make sure mommy and daddy are holding on to those crayons while you are circling. Make it nice and neat. Boys and girls watching, did you catch that right blend? And circle it. Good. And then red crayons down. <coughs> Cyrus, what blend did you circle? Tell me the letters. J and A. Yes. If you circled this one right here, J and A, you did it right. Way to go. All right, hands in your lap. Let's see. Hmm, let's do another one. I got it. Maybe you have eaten this at snack time. Jello. Jello. J -e Jello. If you like Jello, touch your nose. Oh, what's your f f favorite Jello, Angelina? Rainbow. Rainbow? Oh, I've never seen rainbow jello, but I bet you that tastes good. What's your favorite, Kyla? Strawberry. The strawberry, the red kind. Oh, that is so yummy. I like the cherry with and I put whipped cream on it and it's so delicious. Circle the blend that you hear in jello with your green. With your green crayon. And then green crayons down. Lucia, what blend did you circle? Tell me the name. The J and the E. The J and the E. Great job. Boys and girls watching, did you get that one too? Good. Great job. All right. I see that our Jaguar is wearing clothes. If you went to the zoo, would you see a jaguar wearing clothes? No. No. Maybe he's part of our poem. He has to dress up in his clothes before they open up the gates. I don't know. So let's take out our purple crayon. And I see that he has a purple shirt on. So I want you to color his shirt purple. Color his shirt purple. Do a nice job. I'm going to come check your work. Boys and girls watching you get out your purple crayon. Check. Mommy and daddy are holding on tight. Those babies are tucked in. And that you color inside the lines. And I'm going to check those circles and see how we did with our fun game. Oh, I see some nice papers. Great job. Nice work. Can I scooch you in the right way? Let me scoot Joseph over into his spot. There you go. Tuck your toes. But I see some nice papers over here. Good circles. Bless you. Good circles. Very nice. Oh, he's so cute. Such a cute little jaguar. Mm-hmm. Good job. You wish you had a jaguar for a pet? No. Oh, I don't know, Angelina. He sure looks cute on our paper, but I don't know. Because a jaguar is what kind of an animal? A wild a animal. A wild animal, yes. But it would be fun. 
He might. I think he might bite us. But it would be fun to go look at them at the zoo. It sure would be. You can take out your green crayon if you're done with the purple shirt and color his green shorts. You can color his green shorts. <clears throat> Don't get his spots colored purple or green. God gave him those brown spots, not purple and green ones. That would be silly. Mm -hmm. It would be silly. It would be. But God made him special. God made them different, just like he made us all different. God made all the animals different, so we know how to look at them. We know that he is not a zebra because he doesn't have what? Stripes. He doesn't have stripes. And we know that the zebra is not a jaguar because he doesn't have those spots. So God made them all different, made them special so that we could see them and like them and maybe think we could have them as a pet. Maybe so, someday. Oakley, finish coloring your paper. You're doing a great job. Keep it up, Jonathan. Keep coloring your paper. You're doing great. Keep coloring your paper. I like this hard work. Boys and girls watching, I hope you're doing a great job on your paper. Keep finishing and doing your best coloring and keep working on those blends. Hope you're keeping these papers and using those blend letters every day and helping to make new words so that you can read. And then pretty soon, you'll get to read the Bible all by yourself. That's going to be so much fun.